Hello everyone. So I have a small little box opening. Um, this is not a reborn. This is another Blythe doll. And it's gonna be a little different. I do have Ebony out here. She wants to uh, meet her new sister. And so if you don't wanna watch, uh, sorry, <laughs> but it's another Blythe doll. It's not gonna be like Ebony. Um, she's not gonna close or anything like that. This one is from a different seller off Etsy. And this, uh, this Blythe comes already ready to be customized which I'm gonna be doing, not the same thing, but I'm gonna be customizing her um, like I did Ebony. So I thought I would still come on and show you because she's a little different than Ebony, just a little bit. So, um, the person that I got her from is actually a YouTuber as well. Um, there's just a little, little letter with and she also came with four sets of free eyes um, along with the four she already comes with but um, it's just explaining about resin chips and new dolls that she has her social media um, and she's clipped the eyes that I picked um, here on there and I will show you a close-up of those um, I'm hoping you guys will be able to see them there's these blue ones these are like a teal green there's these uh, pink ones and then these really really light blue ones they're almost white they have um, blue rims around them. So I got those for free. Here she is. Very nicely wrapped. This one is an icy blight. They're just slightly different, but um, I just fell in love with her. And the price was so good for what you got um, with the eyes and everything. So I kind of had a plan for her, uh, but I don't know. I may end up changing my mind once I once I you know knew once I saw her, um, then I would know. But this is her. She's so cute. And she's nude. Sorry if it bothers anybody. Look at her hair. Her gorgeous purple hair. Her head move? Oh, her head's like got a joint in it. Now on her string uh, for the IC Blights, they don't have the ring. They have this right here, which says Angela. Um, but let's look at her eyes. So these are purple, brown, orange um those could be like pink let's see yeah it's like really light pink and then her purple oh she's even it even feels different um to uh to to click this back here it's even different she's just beautiful she is beautiful 
and her new eyes are gonna look great on her. Yeah, I'll eventually do the sleepy eyes with her. Um, I like that her head moves, that's really cool. Yeah, she's really cool. I like her. Hey guys, so I brought them inside to make it a little bit easier on me to show you guys the difference between the two girls. And I wanted to get the new one dressed. I've got this cute little sweater dress on her that I originally had gotten for Ebony. I was going to dye it, but it, it actually looks really cute on her. I put her hair back in a ponytail so we can see her face a little bit better. Um, and I wanted to show you guys the difference between the two of them. So they're exactly the same size heads and, and the length and everything is the same. Uh, body wise, the only difference is Ebony is bigger chested. This body that she's on is bigger chested than what the Icy Blythe has. Now, Ebony's face is not as round as the Icy. So the Icy has definitely fuller cheeks. Um, their ears are different. This is the Icy ear and this is the Neo ear. I have to say I do not like um, the Icy ear very much, but she is going to probably get different ears. The other thing that's different is their mouths. Ebony's definitely has fuller lips and it's more of a frown, whereas the Icy has more of a smile or like a cute little smirk. Um, the noses are a little different. It's very little. Um, it's not as round. So like, I'm trying to get side profile here. So there's, the icy nose side profile and here is Ebony's so it's just slightly different a little bit smaller and their eyes the icy has more of an almond shaped eye and Neo has more of a round eye um, I mean other than that I don't see much of a difference um, she does have, um, I see the I see print in the back. Um, you guys probably won't be able to see it, but it says I see TM 2009 R, R, -ker, R -per. Mm, I can't see it all that great. It looks like A R K E R made in China. So, um, now the eyes that I got for her will not fit Ebony. They'll only fit the Icy. Icy's have just slightly smaller eyes than a Neo, but, um, they're too big. So like a Midi, I wouldn't be able to put Midi eyes on her they wouldn't fit and I wouldn't be able to put Neo eyes on her. They wouldn't fit. She has to actually have to have icy eyes. Uh, this lady makes them. So these four sets that I got her will only go on an icy. So I don't know if she'll get all of them. I really do like the brown and the purple on her eyes. Uh, I may save these if I ever get another icy. But um, I think that Put your shirt down, Ebony. I think she's adorable and I love her sweet little face. And I cannot wait to get started on her. Um, just have to figure out what exactly I want to do. I've been sort of um, tossing things around. I've been sort of shopping for her a little. It's just been kind of hard because I, I have something in my head, but I wanted to see her first. So, um, you know, I, this type of, these type of dolls are not, have never been my thing. Um, I just always have been a reborn person. I, like I had Barbies and stuff when I was young, but 
that was about it. Um, I have wanted a BJD for a long time, but those were out of my price range. So um, Lexi bought me my first Monster High. She thought I would really like it because of the big head and stuff. Um, bigger than a regular Barbie. And, you know, she thought they would ever really like them. Um, and it sort of took off from there. And she had mentioned that there were these type of dolls and I have been obsessed ever since. <laughs> so thank you, Lexi. <laughs> um, I just absolutely love looking at things on Etsy that they have for these guys and on eBay and just, I'm obsessed. It's just terrible. <laughs> I have all of this stuff saved, uh, like window shopping <laughs> on, uh, on Etsy for these guys. Um, so yes, I'm very excited to have my second one and I think she's absolutely adorable and uh, I cannot wait to get started on her. Um, yeah, I just need to, you know, look at some drawings that I've made and some pictures and that I had and just sort of go from there. Um, but she's very, very sweet. And, uh, I think these two are they're gonna look really cool whenever they're this one's done they're gonna look cool together so anyway thank you so much for watching and if you guys are interested I can show you like work in progress on her um, you know you never know where this is gonna take me but I really do love their size and they're so much fun um, so you know you never know we'll see what happens but um, yeah, I can do some work in progress videos once I get started on her. So you guys take care of yourselves. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you soon.